Good morning, folks. We're going to hit the tropical activity in the eastern part of the world, a new mission dissecting the atmosphere, and a paper on significant Starlink satellite losses during the May solar storm. We're starting with a very quiet last 24 hours on our star, definitely a little nap being taken by the sun at the moment. No significant solar flares, we remain in C-class range. Solar wind and geomagnetic conditions are quiet. We're monitoring the sunspots and plasma filaments, but so far they have remained stable and calm. So let's head over to the West Pacific and North Indian Ocean. Several days ago we said tropical systems would hit the Philippines and then develop east of India. They have done exactly that. Philippines being impacted heavily now and that storm is moving slowly. While the one developing in the Bay of Bengal is going to tighten up and then head north in the next few days. High watch levels here. And then after hitting the Philippines, we do expect that storm to survive and continue west towards Vietnam after skirting south of China. Eyes open in affected areas. Folks, a new mission called EarthCare is able to peer into clouds and layers of the atmosphere like no mission before. Its ability to see everything from aerosol content to dissecting storm clouds and seeing what's in each layer is a huge step up from the previous missions of this kind. This includes a rapid enough cadence to monitor development and changes to a system over short periods of time. Lastly, folks, nobody should be surprised by this one. Data is in and it is confirmed that several Starlink satellites were lost in the May 2024 solar superstorm. Interestingly, the ramp up in activity began the orbital abnormalities while the storm itself put the nail in their coffins and caused re-entry and loss of the craft. They do seem to be the most vulnerable of the satellites even if it is due to their abundance. Lastly, folks, I will be out at the ranch tomorrow. We've got tons of other stuff happening this fall, and we would love to see you in person. That journey begins at ObserverRanch.com. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now, it's 5.35 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.